If you're a website owner or online marketer, then this video is going to teach you how to tap into the millions and millions of people already using YouTube to get discovered and get new visitors coming to your website. Now you're probably familiar with YouTube already or use it yourself to watch videos. Here you're going to learn why it is such a great idea for you as an internet marketer to use in order to leverage all of the people already there searching for what you have to offer. First of all, 4 billion videos are viewed on YouTube alone every single day. That's a lot of people there already waiting for you and people are using YouTube as a search engine as a way to find information that they need just like when you Google something or use Yahoo or Bing the other interesting thing is if you make a video then that video is 53 percent more likely to come up in Google search results when someone is searching for something online than if you were trying to get a certain page of your website found, which is very interesting. It's an easy, it's yet another way to get discovered. And of course, it is a free and easy source of web traffic for you. It just takes a little bit of time to work into your schedule, and you can have consistent visitors coming to your website or squeeze page. The other cool thing about using YouTube as an online marketer is that there are two ways to win. You get to double dip in the traffic pool. Now the first way is by posting a video in YouTube where people find it and watch it and either see a link or find out the web address that you want them to go to. The second way is how your video can come up as a result in search engines like I said so that not only people in YouTube searching can find you but people just googling random topics can find you and this can put you so far ahead of your competition that might be spending months or years trying to get a number one spot. So here's how to produce and distribute your first YouTube video in three simple steps. The first step is to record a simple video. We'll show you a couple different kinds that you can use to get started. It could be as simple as using your camera phone without having any software available to you. Then you're going to upload the video to YouTube and enter in certain settings that will make it easier for people to find your video from within YouTube's already uh, large amount of traffic. And then lastly, you'll want to share the video with your own friends, family, list, and so on in order to get the comments and the likes started. So the first step is to make a video that you're going to share with the world. What kind of video could you make, you might be wondering. Well, the best way, in my opinion, is to make a tutorial video that shows people how to do something, perhaps something that you're doing in your own online marketing business, teaches them how to do it and offer them a link to click on if they want to learn more. You can also make promotional videos which advertise something that you want to offer for sale or some reason why you want them to come to your website. You can also make personal videos that you share with your subscribers giving an update of how you're on vacation or whatever seminar you're going to and so on. But reviews of an affiliate product are probably the simplest and, and smartest way to go about making a video in the very, very beginning. This could be as simple as a video of your talking head that you make with your own phone camera, talking about the product you purchased, why you got it, the results you got, and then give a strong call to action at the end saying, if you want to find out more, click on the link below. Or, as you can see from this example here, you can create what's called annotations in YouTube. Once you've uploaded it, then you can add it, so you don't even need to have any kind of video editing software. But you can create text boxes and bubbles like the one you see here next to Spider-Man uh, that pop up and encourage people to go to your website. And here you can write again your website, your affiliate link, the place they need to go, and it's doubly reinforced right in their face, so they're more likely to click on it or type it in to their web browser and go to your link where they can subscribe or make a purchase. This could be as simple as a video of your talking head in your living room that you take with a phone camera that someone else holds for you or that you set up and just explain what it was that you purchased, the uh, affiliate marketing product or service, why you got it, what the benefits have been to you, what kind of results you've seen from it so far, and then a call to action at the end telling people why they should click on the link to find out more about this product 
for themselves. Another thing here I wanted to show you an example of in this, this Spider-Man video is an annotation. Do you see the text box coming out of his mouth? This is where in your videos, once you upload them to YouTube, you can make it so that the website or link you want them to go to appears on the screen where they can see it there and be more likely to click it or type it into their web browser than if they only saw a smaller text link in the information below the video. In step two, you're going to upload your video to YouTube and enter in the settings we'll show you to type in so that people who are searching for what you have to offer will find your video. Now once you go to YouTube, if you have an account, it's pretty simple just to click on upload and start uploading or submitting a video. Now you'll want to enter certain information to help people find you and that information is called keywords or keyword phrases. These are the words that people enter when they're searching for something specific. So for example, if I were searching for how to build a square foot garden, then build square foot and garden would be the most relevant keywords. Don't worry too much about a or the and things like that. You're going to want to name your video when you save it. The file name should have those keywords in it. I would just make it build-square-foot-garden, right? So the phrase with dashes or hyphens connecting them. Then when you upload it, it's going to ask you for the title of the video. Make that the keyword phrase as well or have it the phrase in it, preferably towards the beginning. And also in the video description, this is where you write what the video is about. Include the keyword phrase again and some other text explaining what they're going to learn. And very important here, the very first thing in your description should be the link that you want people to click on to buy whatever it is that you are promoting. And lastly, it will ask you for video tags. This is where you take all the keywords you can think of that have to do with your video and enter them in one at a time with commas between them, such as square, comma, foot, comma, garden, comma, build, comma, gardening, comma, do it yourself, comma, something along those lines. Now here's a live example of this with one video. As you can see, I've highlighted the title of the video, and if square foot garden or build square foot garden, building, etc. were my keywords, then this title would be perfect for that. Also take a look down in the description, they use the keyword again, build a square foot garden in the last sentence. What's missing here? That would be a link to go somewhere. It should be the very first thing down at the bottom in your description so that people will make sure to see it without having to click to see even more. That's going to help you get more traffic right there as a secret. The final step once your video is made and set up in YouTube is to share it with others. And once your video is up, then you'll want to send some other people to see it because even though some folks will find it just by searching around in YouTube, there's other things within your power that you can do to get even more people seeing it and to get the first initial comments and likes so that when subsequent people come across the video, they'll be more likely to do the same. The first thing you can do is announce your YouTube video by posting the link on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn if you use it, or other social media sites in order to let people know, here's this cool video I made, check it out. Your friends and family will see it, or the people you're promoting to will see it. Same thing goes for your email list. Send a, an email to all of your subscribers and let them know you have a new video that they might be interested in, and there it is. Now an even better way to do that is to embed the video on your blog first by making a quick and easy web page that shows the video and maybe some other text around it explaining what it is and why you put it up and then email the link to that to your subscribers because frankly you want them coming to your website and not to YouTube where they can get distracted by whoever and whatever. And the last thing you can do to get more people finding your video and coming to your website in the first place is to post it on other video sites like Vimeo, Viddler and so on. There's a bunch of these. Basically, I wouldn't post it on more than five. Uh, basically, just do YouTube at first, but this is something extra that you can do to help you get found by even more people later on. So that is discussion forum marketing in a nutshell. Again, I challenge you to make 50 posts and see how much traffic comes to your website as a result. How many new subscribers you got, how many sales came from the people who visited your page, thanks to your comments. 
If you've enjoyed this easy traffic generation method and would like to learn new ways in the future, make sure to click subscribe to this channel and stay tuned for more videos to come. So that's the one, two, three step process of creating and posting a YouTube video. If you want to have even more traffic and sales in the future, then post more videos. Make a schedule, do one a week, two a week, whatever you can fit. And if you're interested in learning even more ways to attract new visitors, leads, and make new sales and make money online, click the subscribe button below and follow us in order to see future videos coming out soon.